Um, so I'm 40 this year and it's a yes and no answer. Uh, yes, I did think of being a businessman uh, since I was a little kid. And in fact, until I was five, I couldn't speak. And uh, obviously my mom was very worried, but when I could speak, uh, they couldn't shut me up. Um, and at five, I remember uh, my mom told me in front of the class, I said, I want to be a businessman. No, is that I never imagined that we would be stewards of a marketplace that serves millions of users and millions of driver partners and, and merchants across the whole region. Uh, but you know, our, our work just got started. It is still day one for us. And there's a lot of uh, mistakes we still make. We still need to keep improving, own those mistakes and keep iterating every day. As a shareholder myself, you know, of course, uh, do we feel the pain? For sure. Uh, what we can say is that, look, there's a lot of extraneous circumstances and we hold ourselves accountable to shareholders, uh, to investors. What we are focused on is executing that strategy. And what's the strategy? Simple. We're in the early innings of digital transformation in Southeast Asia. Uh, we're very excited about our deliveries business. We're very excited about our financial services business. Uh, we have seen how it's grown uh, year on year. We've seen how the EBITDA margins has improved and we are driving that cost to serve down by using technology. As a tech company, I think globally, uh, it's not easy to get you know, the best engineers or or the best uh, data scientists. Uh, how we tackle it is by number one, making sure that you know, the table stakes of compensation is, is competitive, right? It's competitive benchmark. Number two is making sure that we are hiring mission oriented uh, folks around the world. Uh, you know, I learned this from Amazon, right? That uh, from Jeff and, and from Andy Jesse was they hire missionaries, not mercenaries. And for us, you know, how do we get the best mission-orientated people that really want to solve real problems in Southeast Asia. What do we argue about? We don't argue. My wife calls her the wife in office. It's a very brotherly, sisterly uh, environment. I think we have very active debates, but I think in general, most of the time, we've been quite aligned in, actually, in fact, in all decisions, we. We make it as one voice together. I don't even argue with my wife, so... Uh, so... <laughs> okay. Very blessed to have two incredible women to really uh, help me grow as a leader. The last Netflix I watched was a few weeks ago. I watched Incredible Hulk. I have to catch up, right? So it's been years, so, so I'm still catching up. Uh, <laughs> no, but I, I like, you know, sometimes the week can get pretty stressed, so watching something so like out of there, uh, so crazy, sort of is a way of just, you know, having the mind relax and think, not think about work. I, I actually like listening to audiobooks uh, and uh, one book that I just recently completed was a book uh, called Execution, a great book. Another book that I just uh, bought, it's uh, Ray Dalio's latest book about how countries succeed or fail. Yes, I am a Platinum member. I used a normal uh, account. I have uh, 11,518 points. Most of the time I use either the ride hailing service uh, or the food service and sometimes I use both a few times a day. <laughs> when Jeff Bezos' two pizza teams fell short, he turned to the brilliant model Amazon uses today. It's an ink article. When I think of rain, I think about making sure that there's supply to serve our consumers well. I think about the Grab uh, Venture Velocity, which was a basically uh, how we help other startups across the region. No, <laughs> I think about GVV, Grab Venture Velocity. 
Oh, I think green. <laughs> I naturally think crab. And as you can see, it's also on my on my uh, wrist. Oh my goodness, I'm so one-dimensional. Only thing about grab, holy cow. I would rate the interview I did today I mean, three star out of five. You know? Not a five-star driver. Yet. <laughs> Thanks so much. I don't have a favorite Korean drama. I don't watch Korean dramas, but my wife does.